Thank you for joining with us today um, and sharing this time of worship with us. And I pray that, like me, you've been enlightened by Kim's sermon. Oh, God knows. That's one thing I do know. God knows. And I thank God that he has revealed his purpose and his plan for the world through these prophetic writings of Daniel, as well as the other prophets, and that the systems of this secular world in which we're living in will be defeated by Christ. Because Christ is our rock, our strength, and our redeemer. And it says in verse 22 of our reading today, and I, I will read, God reveals deep and hidden things. He knows what lies in darkness and light dwells in him. And that reminded me of one of the Psalms of Psalm 36 verse 9, which is uh, about God and it says, For with you is the fountain of life, and in your light we will see light. Fascinating. We come from the darkness into light, and we see this through the prophetic words of Daniel. Before I pray, I, I just see sitting down here beside me um, this book that we quite often read every day with Jesus. And I notice it says there, teach us to pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. We need to pray that, but we ought to pray like Daniel, that things will be revealed to us, the hidden will be revealed to us through these words. And it's my prayer that we stand in God's light and commit ourselves to wait for him to reveal his plans for us, to us, and in his time. And to be like Daniel in this time, to stand firm against the pressures of the world, to conform to his values. Father, we commit ourselves to you. We commit our life to prayer and to wait for you.